but much harder. So much easier to take the shortcut, keep lawyers and peer wizards on retainer and preach platitudes to the un that needs to be done every day. Mr. Jepson's commands appear to be a warning to Meghan and Harry not to forget their concerns of British public. His remarks also subtly urge the couple not to delve into too deep into our story to follow in the footsteps of Dinah with the private ventures and design to remain relevant outside the royal family. Mr. Jepson warned the successes were already starting to lose touch with the public and suggested that they could be about to cross the rush of the world stage and the shallow flattery of international rich and famous. As perhaps a younger son, Harry, has discovered, you can escape the palace by finding relevance and respect at just another celebrity as much, scientists, princes, and dukes and duchesses intend, but it's the risk they run when they lose touch with real people's everyday concerns, when the personal enthusiasms take priority over much less glamorous traditional royal work of healing and encouraging blind. He wrote in the Daily Mail, Once outside the royal fold, Dinah would increasingly rely on billionaires for jets and bodyguards, for photo opportunities and speech platforms. People whose agendas and publicity instincts began and Marco and Prince Harry lost touch with British public. Dinah's ex eyed his out. Meghan Marco and Prince Harry are losing touch with real people and risk for getting lightened matches. Pretty soon, you have crossed the line from setting a good example. All a member of the royal family really has to do to setting yourself up an expert in public policy without the trouble of winning an election. It's surely not what can celebrity well and remember their roots in the royal family. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex stood down as senior members earlier this year and have since moved to Santa Barbara, California. Since leaving the royal toad, the couple has started participated in number of what is important, according to Princess Diana's former aide. Patrick Jepson, Princess Diana's long-standing private secretary, has given a detailed account of the late royal's final years away from the firm. The formal aide suggested Meghan Markle and Prince Harry and ended with their own interests. The temptation for somebody of the today's royal family is to leave Floyd Diana after Panorama. No longer anchored to their humdrum concerns of the British subjects, preferring the egg for three events where they have commented on issues such as mental health, the media and the Black Lives Matter movement.